Hey guys, just finished up with uh, some extra lighting on the uh, Corvallis. Uh, saw the interior lighting and then the last flight I had out there I really couldn't see a whole heck of a lot of it. Uh, not the way I really wanted to. So we've done a couple other little modifications here and uh, I'll try to show you. Dim, dim this top light here and uh, kind of dim it down. That should make it a little bit better. Okay, so just kind of pretend the light's getting dimmer. Okay, and now we're starting to see it a little bit. Okay, and if I turn this light off here, then you get this view. Okay, but now I went ahead a little, a little bit further, and uh, just bear with me a second. I'm looking at the camera here, and got my transmitter. We're in the dark. And, voila, we have lights. Okay, so I get to use lights by remote. Yes, we're hooked up. <laughs> so I've got a, a flashing on this top, um, flashing strobe on top. And then down under here, I've got the, uh, I've got a red, you know, beacon strobe. I decided to put another beacon, flashing beacon up in the front with a slow blow green on the front or on the, on the right wing uh, along with the, uh, what it comes with here. And then, uh, you know, this side set up pretty much the same. Now the interesting thing about this uh, particular uh, GT light system, it's a GT light system, it's not the cheap one, it's about $10 more is that this one has the switchable uh, programming. So you can have it this way. Let's see if I can get back here a little bit and make sure you guys get a good view. Okay, get it this way. How's that? Get it this way. this one. That one's kind of cool, the way the lights flash up in the front. There's this one. I think there's eight different modes on this one, guys. There's all on, except for the slow blows. Then you've got them all flashing. Then you've got them all flashing slow. And then just all on. So all on might be kind of kind of nice just for for nice slow flight, uh, or you can just turn them all off. Kind of cool, huh? But uh, yeah, pretty neat. Run them through real quick again. That one kind of looks like a cop plane. Put red and blue up there, that'd be fun. And then all on, I guess. And all flashing fast. I believe the system will start flashing fast once it senses uh, less than 3. Point, I think it's 3.6 volts going to the receiver. I'm not sure how that works. And then all on. I think I'll probably be using that for flight. I'll see it all the time. And then off if you don't want to, if you want to conserve battery. So, cool. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll have this one up in the air again very soon and uh, probably get to see it.